Hi, this is Dr. Das and today I am presenting this video of a coblation tonsillectomy. Coblation is by far the most uh, recent advancement in tonsil surgery. This is the machine, the machine which is called Coblator 2. This is a wand. This is a EVAC Extra 70 which is used with, for tonsillectomy. This is the microscope. I normally use microscope for this surgery and this is the assembly, the microscope the patient position and the instruments now uh, the surgery is done under microscopic vision and that is the reason why I can achieve a bloodless field during the surgery now this coblation van is being used to dissect the tonsil and this van has got three ports one port it carries the saline to the field and thereby uh, pours the saline onto the tissues and reduces the temperature of the dissection area to just 60 degrees unlike a laser which cuts the tissues at 600 degrees and as a result can cause a lot of collateral thermal damage. Now this dissection is being done at around 60 to 70 degrees and if you notice the tip of the instrument is not touching the tissues which are being dissected it is the side of the instruments so basically the technology is the saline passes through the tip and at the same time the current the radio frequency current also passes through the tip from a different port and this radio frequency energy uh, cleaves the bond of sodium chloride which is the saline and uh, produces sodium and chloride ions and this sodium ion uh, forms a plasma uh, energy field and this plasma does the tissue dissection thereby sealing the blood vessels even before it is cut and that's why you can see the surgery is almost absolutely bloodless and taking the microscope there is a big advantage of it because of the microscope I am able to see the capsule differentiate the capsule of the tonsil from the deeper tissues the muscle layer so these muscles are not damaged at all I can do my dissection exactly along the capsule using this coblation and microscope and then that's why the patient will have very little pain in the post-operative period because the muscles in the tonsillar fossa is not exposed as you saw the surgery is entirely bloodless and a uh, lot of advantages of this technique the healing is faster after surgery and pain is absolutely minimum and blood loss is zero thank you